Welcome to Hunter Hunter Theory. Who is Hisoka disguised as? Hisoka will be fighting the Phantom Troop in Black Whale. In this video, we'd like to compile readers' predictions and show you why. The candidates are Arumi, Banolanov, Bellarain, and Krolo. 1. Arumi Arumi is still considered by far the most likely candidate. Arumi was revealed to have joined the Phantom Troop in Volume 36, but there are too many descriptions that make us think that this Arumi is Hisoka in disguise. Here are six simple reasons why. The first reason is the line, Hi, I'm Arumi. This is the line Arumi said when he introduced himself to the Phantom Troop. In the Japanese version, it is written like this. In Japanese, it is pronounced the same way, and can be read as, defeat is Arumi. From this expression, one might expect that Hisoka and Arumi had already finished their battle by the time he introduced himself, and that Arumi had been defeated as a result. The second reason is Arumi's first person. First of all, about the first person, there are many ways to refer to myself in Japanese. Or, Boku, Watashi, etc. all mean the same thing as I in English, but each of them has a different detailed meaning. Or is generally used by men and has a slightly casual and strong impression. Boku is also generally used by men, but unlike or, it is more likely to be used by small children or reluctant men. In Hunter x Hunter, Arumi mainly used or. However, in Volume 36, Arumi's first person changed to Boku. As you may have already noticed, Hisoka uses Boku as the first person. In addition, many readers felt that Arumi's speech is different from usual, and he seems to be in a playful mood. The third reason is the shape of Arumi's hands. This is Ri in Japanese, and I think it represents the first letter of Hisoka. This pose was also created by a Japanese idol group called Hinata Zaka, based on the first letter of their group name, Ri. The author of Hunter x Hunter is very fond of this group, which can be inferred from the fact that he also likes its sister group, Hiyaki Zaka. Silent Majority is the name of a song by Hiyaki Zaka, and the character itself is very similar to the group's center, Hirate Yurina. The Hanada Zaka pose may have been used as an allusion to Hisoka. The fourth reason is the statement, I need to take a shower. This is a line Arumi said in a conversation with Mizaistam. While the Mafia families in the Kakin Empire and Luini of the Heil Li family have committed serial murders on board, Mizaistam has declared martial law on board and restricted the free movement of passengers. Arumi was no exception and was told to go to the third tier room, where Arumi said, I'd prefer a cell with a shower. Arumi did not seem to care about cleanliness as he spent a lot of time in the dirt during the Hunter exam plate competition, and Hisoka is the very character who takes a shower in Hunter x Hunter. Hisoka is always keeping his body clean after his match with Castro at Heaven's Arena and when he meets Gon and Kirua at Greed Island. Therefore, the I need to take a shower comment is one of the reasons why we can expect that Arumi is Hisoka. The fifth reason is, spoilers, I dare say. This is probably the most famous one, but the expression, spoilers, I dare say, by Tagashi on the back cover of volume 36 has become a topic of conversation. There is also a picture of a mouth on the back cover. And if you look at the cover of volume 36 again, you will see that Arumi's mouth is not drawn on the cover. Tagashi may have spoiled the story that Arumi is already dead, since there is a saying, dead men tell no tales. The sixth reason is Maki and Kaluto's point of view. This is the scene where Maki and Kaluto are staring at Arumi when the troop breaks up to go look for Hisoka. It is possible that Maki, who seems to be closest to Hisoka in truth, and Kaluto, Arumi's brother, are the only two people who have doubts about Arumi's mood and suspect Hisoka of being in disguise. I've introduced six reasons why Hisoka is now expected to be disguised as Arumi, but with so many reasons, I'm inclined to think that Tagashi is misleading us. 2. 
Benolanov. The next most predictable is Benolanov. Benolanov, with his bandages wrapped around his body, looks as if he is asking to be disguised. Here are three reasons why. The first reason is the backs of the covers of volumes 35 and 36, and the cover of volume 36. The picture on the back cover of volume 35 shows one eye. And the word is, eye. The picture on the back of volume 36 has a picture of lips and the words, spoilers, I dare say. And the cover of volume 36 depicts each of the troop members. If we look at Benolanov, one of his eyes is covered by a bandage, and his mouth is also obscured by a bandage. Bonolyonov's mouth is basically hidden, but both of his eyes were visible when he first appeared, and both of his eyes were visible during the battle with Chimera Ant. Therefore, the meaning of the back cover of Volume 35 and 36 and the cover of Volume 36 may be, look out for Benolanov. The meaning of, spoilers, I dare say, on the back cover of Volume 36, in addition to Urumi's theory introduced earlier, can be changed to, Bill the Assassin, when, lips, is read in Japanese, as shown here. There have been various theories, such as that Bill, is the culprit of, Silent Majority. Which one is true, and which one is false? The second reason is Shizuku's gaze. If you look at Shizuku's eyes in this scene, it looks like she is looking at Benolanov behind her on the left. After this, Benolanov and Shizuku propose to Krolo that, Krolo, can we team up? This is because Shizuku somehow felt something wrong with Benolanov, and Benolanov said he would work with Krolo, so she said she would go along with Krolo, and now the three of them are working together. In fact, Shizuku seems to be a carefree person, but she cares about the Phantom Troop and its leader, Krolo. When Nobunaga and Finks were about to fight, Shizuku stopped them and said, breaking the rules means rejecting the spiders, and Krolo, too. This line shows how much she cares about Krolo. If this reason is true, Shizuku's fighting power is no match for Hisoka, so will Krolo really be able to protect Shizuku? The third reason is, Metamorphosin. This is the name of a new ability that Benolanov suddenly mentioned during a conversation between Krolo, Shizuku, and Benolanov. Shizuku says, I'm going to look for Hisoka in disguise, and then, same as Shizuku, but I transform rather than disguise. Battle Contabile Metamorphosin. I can take many forms, depending, but I'm not smart enough to come up with a plan. I need your help, said Benolanov. This means that Benolanov has the ability to transform at any time. Some readers may have felt uncomfortable with Bonolyonov's sudden revelation of his ability to transform in this scene. I wonder if Metamorphosin is an ability that Hisoka said to deceive Krolo. I am very curious about this too. These are the three reasons why Benolanov is expected. 3. Bellerint. Next up is Bellerint, the bodyguard of Mariam, the 13th prince of the Kakan Empire. Bellerint is a hunter and Nen user. He is currently attending a Nen training session held by Karapika and was thanked for helping Karapika when Karapika was being bashed by other participants. Now, Bellerint and Karapika are on good terms, and if Bellerinte's intention is to keep a cooperative relationship with Karapika, he has succeeded. And Bellerint is tall, about the same height as Hisoka, and in the Japanese version, his tone and speech are similar to Hisoka's. Hisoka has worked with Karapika once in the York New City arc, so we can assume that Hisoka is very much aware of Karapika's abilities. It is possible that even Hisoka is approaching Karapika first, judging that it would be tough for him to fight alone against Troop. If this theory is true, it shows Hisoka's seriousness in hunting Troop by any means necessary. And if this theory is true, Karapika's life expectancy is already shortening due to the excessive use of Emperor time, and this will further increase the burden on Karapika. He has to protect Oido and Wobel, defeat Troop with Hisoka, and get back Scarlet Eyes from Serednik. 
Sadly, it's hard to imagine Karapika being alive by the time he reached the Dark Continent. 4. Krolo The last one is Krolo, the leader of the troop. The reason why Krolo cannot use lovely Ghost Rider is not because Neon is dead, but because Hisoka is now disguised as Krolo. And it is predicted on the grounds that it is Krolo, not Arumi, that Maki, with his keen intuition, is looking at. If it is Krolo, many readers will be in for a rude shock. I am looking forward to a Krolo vs Hisoka rematch. As I explained in another video, I personally believe that Arumi is working behind the scenes with Hisoka, which means that Hisoka is collaborating with Arumi and Kaluto of the Zoldic family. This would explain why Kaluto does not use his search ability on Hisoka. Hisoka's cool-headed and rational judgment may have led him to ask the Zoldic family to help him instead of sticking to destroying Troop by himself. We are very excited to see how Troop vs Hisoka will fight. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you have any other comments or opinions about this video, I would be very happy to hear them in the comment section. Thank you for watching the video till the end. To all Hunter x Hunter fans, let's continue to enjoy Hunter x Hunter together. I will continue to put up more videos, so please click the good button and subscribe to my channel. See you again in the next video. Ciao!